Hey guys, I've been gone for a while. I actually haven't posted on Instagram since December. I've just been super busy with all my jobs and classes, and I've actually been on a huge number of like super fun shoots this year. Some of which I can't tell you about because NDAs exist. Let's talk about the other ones. One of the first shoots that I worked on this year was a music video called Grandma's Kitchen. I was the AD on the shoot, so I worked very closely with our DP and director to make sure that everything ran as smoothly as possible. It was a super fun one day shoot, and it was really cool to just be on set and be surrounded by Asian people. It's kind of a unique experience and it's one that I'm really glad that I had. Another shoot that I worked on as an AD was this short film called Amy's Song and the Acceptance Letter. It belongs to a friend of mine. I'm just gonna plug his Instagram here and you can see all of the super cool stunts and like on-set photos and basically behind the scenes of the whole thing. I was on the shoot for four filming days and countless pre-production days. It was a crazy one. I love this cast so much and the stunts are incredible and I'm really excited to see how it turns out. This month I did a little thing with thread up. Look how cute these dresses are. And two of them had pockets. Two out of three. Can you beat that? I am not sponsored for this video but if you want to make me like a brand ambassador or you want to sponsor me, you know, if you have my contact info. I also lent a hand with my favorite art department on a Hallmark film and a series of short films and I just had such a blast with them. Kim and Katie are always such a joy to work with and they are so incredibly good at what they do. Shout out to Amy who attended our art department sleepover. It wasn't a sleepover, we just had a late night on set. And Kyle's alright too I guess. Speaking of Kyle though, season 3 of The New Adventures of Peter and Wendy has premiered! Episodes are coming out now and you should watch them! They were kind enough to invite me to the premiere party. This show has such an amazing cast and crew. Shout out to Sean Deloosh, who was a writer on, I think, the first job that I ever crewed. He's just hilarious. And shout out to Kyle, who created a show that I watched when I lived in Ohio and then got to lend a hand on and is a funny and sweet Peter Pan. I gave you that one, Kyle. I worked on the new Princess Rap Battle, and thank you to Whitney Avalon for bringing me on for that. I hope I can come hang out with you sometime soon on any other shoots that you might have going on. I also did like a lot of acting things that I can't tell you about because, you know, the NDAs that I mentioned earlier. I will keep you all updated on Instagram. I am starting that back up the second that this video is uploaded. I will tell you all about it. So follow me on Instagram. I think that was my plug. I also went on lots of auditions, attended a ton of classes, wrote a few songs, drove about 900 miles, and so much more. Honestly, this year has been so jam-packed. When I started this year, I had nothing scheduled, no jobs on the books or anything, and I was like, this is great. I'm gonna take these open days, I'm gonna make a ton of goals, and I'm gonna get stuff done. So, uh, let's see how many of those I have accomplished. Okay, so that's not that great. I actually owe you guys another YouTube video. I think I'm like one or two behind. Maybe an original song? Honestly, I'm probably only gonna make one or two of my goals by the end of this year. And that's okay. That's great. I'm moving forward. Maybe not in the ways that were previously expected, but forward nonetheless. If you're in the same boat as I am, don't be discouraged about all the things you haven't done. Look at what you've accomplished instead, and keep moving forward. Onwards and upwards. I did not shoot this for the edit. I think everyone will agree with me when I say that pockets make or break an outfit, and every outfit should have pockets.